guys, it's Tracy and today I'm back with another video and I'm going to be doing the what's in my purse or bag tag. I don't know who started this but I'm sure it's been around for like a long long time. So I just wanted to show you guys what's in my bag. So right now I'm using this big bucket bag. It's by Kathy Van Zalen. I think I picked it up at a yard sale for like a dollar. I'm pretty sure that's how much I paid for it. So I have my little antibacterial thing that I keep hanging on my purse because I get like kind of weird with stuff because I had pneumonia like two years ago and I was really, really sick. So I try to like get it on my hands as soon as I can and I'm like paranoid that someone's going to get me sick. And then I keep my keys clipped on here with the carabiner, I think they call it. It's like a pink camo. I got it at Home Depot for like a dollar. And then the outside pocket right here, I keep my phone. That's the only thing in there. And I don't keep anything in the two slide pockets. And, whoops. Um, nothing in there. Little pocket on the front. I have a pair of headphones that I never use. And in the other pocket, I have some Band-Aids. And then in the inside, the pocket on the inside right here, <laughs> antibacterial hand spray. And then some Bath & Body Works coupons that I just got and a Mad About You Bath & Body Works hand soap. And then in this little pocket, I keep my pain medication. And then we have a zipper on the inside here. And I keep these antibacterial hand wipes and some of these things if I need them for that time of the month. Tampon, a purple pen, some tattoo color guard sunscreen to put on my tattoos, a sexy mother pucker gloss stick, just I don't even know what color it is, and this oh so party by Victoria's Secret rollerball, a pink pen, a rubber band and a hair coil, uh, some nail files, and a pure lip gloss, another lip gloss, or lip balm I guess it is, and then this Simply Bell. It's like a little sample. I don't even know who makes it. And then I have a little mirror that's got like magnified on one and regular on the other and then I also keep a pair of tweezers and I keep this little marble that my husband made me he gave this to me like I think after our like second date I want to say so I've had it for a while and he made it he's a glass blower so he made that for me so I carry it in my purse when I'm out or whenever wherever I just have it in my purse so that's what's inside all of the pockets and I didn't, well I guess I did know I had all that antibacterial stuff so I'm not even going to lie. And then let's see, I just went to the grocery store so I have a grocery outlet receipt. I have my wallet, my checkbook, register, it's just a register, I don't write checks except for my rent. And I have some Kleenex and I have a coupon organizer. I have some pure Mentos Pure Fresh gum. I like this flavor. It's really good. What flavor is it? It is spearmint. And then I have a 2017 date book. And I have a 2017-2018 date book. I don't know that I need to. I have my glasses. They are by Guess. Got them at Costco. And then I have just this little plain paper that I put like stuff that I want to buy on the list. Like if I see something like some kind of makeup, something that I'm really like liking that someone else is showing, then I'll like write it down so I don't forget it. And um, yeah, so that's all I am carrying. All oh, that's like a ton of stuff. I know. I mean, I go back and forth. Like I'll carry a lot of stuff, and then I'll pare it down to like a little crossover body bag, and then I don't want to carry anything. I don't carry like makeup to refresh my makeup throughout the day. I. I mean, I don't. I, I never need to. I guess. 
or maybe I need to, I just don't, I don't know. So, oh, my fingernails I have on, um, the brand's called Orly. I know my nails look horrible. I have horrible cuticles. It's called Orly and the color is called Truly Tangerine. And on my lips, I have the Ofra Tuscany liquid lipstick. And I am so loving my eye look today, not to like toot my own horn or anything, but I think it turned out so good the day. And I was just like, oh man, I wish I had a better camera. I just have an iPad, but so you can't really see like the beauty that I can see. Cause it just looks, it's like a cranberry smoky eye kinda. And I don't know, I just think it turned out really good today. And I'm, I'm wearing the Wet n Wild um, Photo Focus Foundation. And um, this is the first time I tried it. I've had it for a while. And you guys know I had it in my makeup bag this week. So I tried it today and it is nice. I mean, for $5.99 and you can usually find it on sale. And they have like, I think 21 colors, I want to say. They have a lot of colors. So I think I got mine in, I want to say classic beige. But today is the first day I'm wearing it. And I mean, I picked out a good color. It matched, which... I don't really know when I go, like, I just look and I'm like, hmm, does it match? Let's see. I don't fake tan or anything, so I'm always the same color because I wear sunscreen too. So, um, yeah, it's a, it's really nice. I mean, I don't have oily skin, so I, I've heard people with oily skin also say that they really like it. So I just think it looked really good. It, like, kind of looks airbrushed. And, I mean, you can still see. I put, like two really thin coats on and like you can still see my freckles and stuff which I'm not mad at I don't know that there's anything that could really cover freckles up maybe there is but I have a lot of them so maybe there's not but anyway yeah I think it turned out really good and on my eyes I used the Jaclyn Hill palette so I just think it turned out good and I only use like three colors so I like the look I thought it turned out good I wanted to show you what was in my bag so now you guys know what I carry around. So if you like this video and you're still watching, you must have liked it. So give me a thumbs up, please. I would really appreciate it. It helps my video get to be seen by other people so that they can find my channel and see all of the fun and weird and crazy stuff that I can come up with. So if you haven't subscribed, hit that red subscribe button, click the little bell, and you'll be notified anytime I upload a new video. And I will catch you guys in my next one. Have a great day. Bye.